Oh, hey. So, they want you to run some supplies out to the guys working at the expansion? Real simple, just take this over to them. That jacket looks real nice. I don't know what Tavia's talking about. Um... What's wrong? Reggie's dead. Clem? You alright? Uh, Carver killed Reggie, definitely you said that. look like you've seen a ghost. Reggie. Reggie's dead. What? What are you talking about? Carver killed him. He pushed him off the roof. Maybe... Maybe it was just an accident. You're an idiot, aren't you? Wasn't no bloody accident. Listen to me. Take this stuff out to those guys and come straight back. Just be safe, okay? Now ain't the time to be calling attention to yourself. I need to go find out what happened. It's quite simple. Got angry. Pushed him. Hey, off Troy! The roof. Clem's just gonna take them boys some nails. Alright. Go on. This is absolutely fecked up. Oh my god. Hey! That ain't your concern. Get that stuff over to them boys. Just follow them cables. Oh my and he's gonna turn into a zombie as well. Oh my god. Laborer, fuck that. Let them do this shit themselves if it's so goddamn important. Whoa, what's going on? Get your fucking hands off you me. You ain't man. gonna force me to do this bullshit. I said, get your hands off me. Whoa. Or what? Chill you out. gonna go tail on me? I'm trying to help you, asshole. Um, yeah, this is a real Reg help. Reggie's Why dead. don't you just worry about yourself? Reggie's dead. Carver killed him. What? You sure? Yeah. Well, did you? Oh. Oh, shit! Fuck! Grab something! Oh my god. It's hammer time, Grim. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Um, am I strong enough to, to do that? Uh, uh, uh. Oh. Uh, get under there, Clem, get under there. Yes! Get a hold left to the sticks escape. Gotta get out of here. Get away from me, you freak. Get away, get away, get away, get away, get away, get away. How are you so fast? Oh my god. Um. Um. Hey. Why? Oh, that was worth it. Ha. There's three of them now. Shit. I don't think I'm strong enough to wield this, though. Okay, maybe I am. Just about. Oh, screwdriver in there. Go down. Go down. Go down. Oh god. Um. Let's grab that. That'll do. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Thanks. Um, can you get off me, please? Oh my god, get off oh. Nice shot. Get up. Get out of there, come on. No. Make me save your ass. Jesus. I was fine, I didn't need your help. Oh, thank God, you're okay. Alright, enough mushy shit. You get back inside right fucking now. I'm sure they got shit for you to do in there. Now! Think I'm fucking around? Now I gotta sit down here and babysit you assholes. Can't do a simple fucking patch job without me here cracking the whip? It was an accident, you douche. Gotta hate that guy. Can I, is there anything else I can pick up? Some rubbish, maybe? <coughs> Who the hell's that? <coughs> Ah, stop! Hey, it's me! Luke! <gasps> no! Yes. Oh my god! Man, bit the hell out of me. Think you drew blood. Uh -huh. Come all this way. I'm gonna hug him. I was worried. We all were. Nah, it's good to see you too, kid. Alright, listen. We ain't got much time. Okay, I followed y'all here best I could. I haven't had a night's rest since y'all got nabbed. And, well, that's the first chance I got to talk to somebody. <laughs> They're everywhere. Okay, they got guards. 
Watching everything. Shh, shh. Luke sounds a little bit crazy. There's a herd of lurkers just south of us. It's bigger than I ever seen around these parts. Carver mentioned that. Said he hopes it passes us. We'll send him this way. That'd be nice. Yeah, I heard folks talking about that, but that ain't so. Okay, it's gonna hit this place. I know it is. Now, I don't know when, but it's coming and it's gonna be soon. See, I've been looking for places to, to get you all free, but I haven't been able to find anything yet. Gonna live crazy. Are you feeling okay? They've all the holes we used when we got out. Are you feeling okay? No. No, I mean, uh, yeah, yes. Sorry. I, I just could use some sleep, you know? Hard to rest when you think a lurker's about to get the jump on you at any, any moment, but yeah. <laughs> You've gone a little bit yeah, crazy. I'm fine, okay? Don't worry about me. It seems dangerous. Well, the whole situation's dangerous, but, well, we're in it now. That's what we got. We just, we just need a plan. You know, a way to get you and, and everyone. Um... Luke! Oh, sorry. Sorry. Shit. Okay, Troy ain't gonna like you being late. Listen, Clem, I need you to meet me here tomorrow about this time. Because I, I need you to get me one of those radios, okay? Do you think you can do that? Just just one of those walkie-talkies. I just need to be able to tell y'all what's going on with them guards. You know, I'll figure out the schedule the patrols are on. I mean, they're, they're all over the place, but I can keep an eye on them for y'all from out here. Look, we ain't gonna be able to shoot our way out of here, so we gotta be careful. Uh, we just gotta be smart. I'll get you okay, one. Yeah, I'll get plan. you one. Okay. okay, I'll get you one. Just go to Thanks, sleep Clint. for a bit, man. I'm so glad I can count on you. Remember, you meet me here tomorrow. I'll try and be here around this time, but if I ain't, just wait as long as you can, because I really need one of those radios. And just let everybody know I'm alright, okay? I'm worried they, uh... Clementine, get out where I can see you. Go on, get out of here. Yep. I'll see you later, Luke. Just go get some sleep, all right? So you're not so much crazy anymore, okay? The hell were you doing? Huh? Hiding from the walkers. Answer me. I was hiding from walkers. Don't go in there, you hear me? That is off fucking limits to you. All right. Chill. Bill Radio wants a word with you up in his office. So get on up there, now. Hmm. Dude, you better go up and see Bill. He doesn't like to wait. Oh my god. So, you should probably go. You should probably go. Wow, this is gonna be bloody fun. Rebecca! What the hell? She's a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Now get in here. Who says the kid's yours? You make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are, and you won't end up over in that chair. Now, you might not believe this mm. after what happened earlier, but I liked Reggie. Sure you did. He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. It's easy to let depression sink in during times like this. But he was weak. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will and weak of character. And we can't have that around here. Not anymore. Not with what we got at stake. I'm just gonna keep You have to be able to contribute. I'm gonna keep quiet. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. You understand? Well, I wish it was different, I do. But they are weak and we are strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock, to keep them safe. Cheeky it's quiet. their nature to follow, not to lead. And we're more alike than you think. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized that back in that cabin, you were scared. But you looked me straight in the eye. Kept your nerve. That's what we need. If we're gonna get through this, the next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you, raised the right way. 
the way my child will be raised. Oh my god. It ain't this herd that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. It's not knowing if I got anyone to hand all this off to. It's Alvin's baby. But I ain't worried about that anymore. It's not your baby. It's Alvin's. Well, even if that was true, it's mine now. You sick man. All right, now. Bill, you there? Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Try really knock the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at when he can. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. Cause we all know what happened this morning. I don't know what that son of a bitch is gonna do next. So you wanna ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up? How is that better? Cause this place will be fucking chaos when that thing hits. No one will be paying any attention to us. And that's when we go. It's our opening. We just gotta figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do hmm. it. What is it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. You know that's not what he's saying, but uh, it does sound dangerous. This shit is all dangerous! So, Kenny, do not speak to me like that. I tell, I guess, okay, I okay, okay, sorry. Maybe Luke could help us. He's outside. He wants a radio to help keep an eye on the guards. Thank you. That's the plan I vote for. You know about Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. Ah. If Luke can tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good time to escape. That seems reasonable. Who knows when that'll be? There was a girl back at Crawford that used church bells to send walkers all over the city. We just need something really loud. The PA system Carver is always using is quite loud. There's some speakers outside the building, pointed toward the parking lot. Ooh. I saw them when we were walking out to the work. Troy's always standing next to one of them. Uh, the crows are in the office. There are a few along the roof. Yeah. I saw the controls. They're in Carver's office. She's right. It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. We just got to get into his office. Why didn't you say something sooner? Because hmm. it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And it's still stupid. <laughs> the sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. You're real difficult to deal with sometimes. Penny. No, that's all right. You ain't exactly a peach either. Luke's in oh no shape God. to help us. You want to put our fate in that guy's hands? It's not happening. Um, he did look pretty rough. The herd is you guys shot. should take a look in the mirror sometime. We need to get out of here soon. And the herd is right there. I'd rather take my chances with them than Carver. Atta girl. Look. It doesn't have to be mutually hmm. exclusive. Getting Luke the radio is helpful whatever we end up doing. It doesn't hurt to have more information. It's true. You know what? Fine. I can get behind that. Okay, so we get that turd radio. <laughs> he keeps us posted on the herd's movement. We fire up the PA thing and bring the walkers to roll over this place. And then what? Get some guns and shoot our way out. I don't know. Whatever we can. We improvise. Then that's not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. <laughs> I figured out what your problem is. You don't think this stuff through. If the end of the plan is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Actually, I do it all the time. Ooh. Hi. First words I ever hear you say, and it's just some crazy, stupid shit. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean exactly? When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. I can't tell you from one of them. Uh, now I don't know who's crazier. Trust me, I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good Oh yeah, covered. Lee figured it out. You seem to know what you're talking about. Lee figured that out. What? It's how we got out of the marsh house. Lee covered me and we walked right through. Really? Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. Yeah, bless you. Alright, what are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. 
We still have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that too. Ooh. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. Oh yeah. Where the hell did she come from? I don't know, but I do like her. We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so you probably won't fall to your death. Great. Mm. That thing breaks all the time. Unless something's changed, it won't support much weight. Come on, up and at him. Don't push her, Kenny. Uh, She's our best bet. It's now or never. I mean that, Clem. Now or never, I guess. That's my girl. We gotta get that rope down. Mike, you wanna boost her up? Come on, kid. Let's do this. Woo! Don't let go. I got you. Uh, 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 get it. Slowly. Awesome. Huh. Why is there no one like on the roof with a gun, you know, patrolling? Try to hurry, all right? Uh, I don't think they're the sharpest guards in the world, but they're no idiots either. And uh, what am I meant to be looking they at? See you not in your bunk. We're all done. Um. Oh. oh shit! He's coming back. I gotta let you go. I can't stand here. Grab something. Oh god. Um. Uh, ah. Grab that. Grab that. Whoa! Alright, be nice and quiet, Clem. We're in trouble. 